the green lights are on and down they come. On the outside lane, it is Greg O'Connor on the outside going up to the number yeah. one spot. Cameron Roll right there in the number two spot. Danny Kay running third. Jack Patrick in the number four spot. They travel at high speed down that back straightaway into the tricky number three corner. Patrick shuffles to the outside back in the fourth spot. O'Connor brings him down from the outside. Patrick remaining back there at the number four spot. Sokolik is dropped back to the number eight position. They rumble down to between turns number three and four. Kick out the rear ends coming off that fourth corner and down the front straightaway. And right behind him, it's Andrew Schartner. We have achieved the halfway point. 15 in, 15 to go. As they race going down, and here is Anthony Lasorto. Anthony goes by his teammate down onto the inside. Going down to between turns number one and two is Anthony wearing the hot shoes right now. He races coming down off at turn number four and down the front straightaway. On to the inside, now on the outside of Cameron Roll. Anthony is on the move. Also making a move, Jack Patrick, Danny Kay, and Andrew Chardner. Chardner looking down on the inside as they all scramble coming off at turn number two. The faster car going up on the outside. O'Connor going right to the outside part of the speedway. And look at Lasorto. He's going to try and use a pick move going down the back straightaway. Can he do it? He may have done it. Works down onto the inside. And a little bit of scraping going on, but everybody gets away from it okay. Anthony is up to the number two spot. Danny Kay advances to the number three spot. There. It is Greg O'Connor. He has led it right from the get-go. He leads going down the back straightaway. They race tight in between the corners. Score, stand by. Down they come. Out of turn number four. The checkered flag is out. And the win goes to Greg O'Connor. Danny Kay got second. Anthony Lasorto third. Ladies and gentlemen, a flag-to-flag -flag win for Greg O'Connor. His second career win, his first this year. Brings it home to victory lane. Greg, did you know that you had one of the best small block drivers behind you those last few laps? Yeah, I seen his number pop up on the board there and was expecting to get rattled up a little bit and we held on to her, so that's not too bad. Did you have any problems out there or were you just cruising? Um, just trying to run as best I could. We've been struggling all year. We're trying to get the car back to where we were last year and it finally felt good to, to run like we've been today. Yeah, we got, a, we got a great start. I mean, we started back in ninth and I think we were in the top five on the first lap or so and I was just going to take my time. I knew I was a little better than some of the cars in front of me because our, our car has just been so hooked up lately that um, anyone could drive it. And um, I made a move for second on, in the lab traffic and then um, tried getting with Greggy. I gave him a few love taps and uh, just just couldn't do it tonight. Didn't have enough. Just yeah, we're getting there. Um, well, we've been there, really. It's just uh, it's so tough to win these races. Anthony's so fast. Greg had a great night tonight. And you don't have any cautions. You just got to try to make the best of it and go when you can. And so. Uh, we were a little short tonight. Uh, I got my eyes on Classic. I think we'll be a really good car for 75 laps, so I'm looking forward to that. And I uh, want to say hi to my son, Michael, who came to the races today. His first time sitting in the grandstands. My wife and my, uh, uh, my father-in-law and mother-in-law are both here. So uh, thank you guys for coming, and thanks, everybody, for uh, coming out. Between three and four. Off that fourth turn, green flag is out. Iosu jumps out in front. Look at Michael Barnes. Barnes is on the outside. He has already taken over the number four spot going down into turn number three. Michael Barnes started in sixth. He went to the outside immediately and pours on the coal. He is now up to fourth. Right behind him, the 55 of Keith Champagne. And a uh, Bill Sharkey hard hit into the foam. To a lot of damage done to the 71 of Bill Sharkey. He's out of the car. He is okay. What a shame. They've been getting every week, they've better, been better. picking up a tenth, a tenth, a tenth, and the car is competitive in a heat race. It's, you know, when they started the first of the year, and now when you got to start all over again, that's that's just yeah. one step forward, ten steps back. They're right there with him. Closes ground as the green comes out. Here comes Barnes on the outside. Michael Barnes charging hard on that high side. Goes by the 98 of Tyler Thompson. Right behind him is Keith Champagne. And Brandon Bellinger in that 0-2. Here's Barnes now looking out of the infine of the 52 of Danzer. Back to the outside between three and four. 
Barnes on the outside, can't do it out there. Meanwhile, Sitterly and Schulich trying to work their way up through traffic, trying to come around the 50 of Dave Gruel. And Sitterly is on the outside, Schulich to the inside. Sitterly now inches ahead of Gruel. Gruel duels with him down into turn number three. And coming through the corners, right behind the double zero of Joe Gosick. Your race leader, the 11 America Iosu, looking for his first win of the year. Joe Gosick running in seven. Here comes Sitterly, though. Takes over the number seven spot, and Gruel spins down here in the corner. Got in a little hot, Randy. The rear end came around on him. He did touch uh, Schulich going by. Iosu out in front, Barnes into the outside. Michael Barnes to the high side of the 52 of Dave Danzer. Gets a good bite off turn number two. Down into the third turn, and Barnes is now running in second. Here comes Keith Champagne. Champagne down to the inside as he can't quite make it happen. And try to get around Tyler Thompson, and Thompson hangs on to the fourth spot. Schiller coming around the high side of Bellinger. Here comes Sitterly now to the inside. Barnes around the outside of Iosu. Barnes on the outside of Iosu down here on the front straight, takes over the lead and pulls away. Look now down to the inside of Tyler Thompson. In between three and four, Thompson trying to run him hard. Can't do it. He and Sitterly both get by Thompson as Tyler Thompson had to wash it up the track. Here is now Iosu. Iosu is in trouble. He has banged it off the inside wall down here trying to get to the pitch. Fluid came out of the 11 of Eric Iosu. No fluid came out of it, rather. A little bit of smoke and a beam. That could be a blown engine on the number 11 of Eric Iosu. The eight of Champagne. Champagne hangs on. Battle for second going on right there. And here comes Sitterly. That's a battle for third. Sitterly and Schulich battling for third. Schulich and Champagne battling for second. But they all trace. Chase the 68 of Michael Barnes. Barnes out in front. Here's Sitterly now down to the inside of Schulich. Sitterly on the inside of Schulich now gets to the inside of uh, Champagne and Sitterly up to the number two spot. Otto Sitterly trying to get that spot back as Sitterly went by both Schulich and the eight ball of Champagne. Checkered flag to Barnes. Second place goes to Sitterly. Third is Schulich, fourth is Champagne. Ladies and gentlemen, for the third time this season, Michael Barnes, the hustler. How does it feel to win? It feels great, I'll tell you what. I mean, it's just, it, it was, it was we, had, we had a good start, the car was real good. And uh, we just, I kind of had a feeling the track was kind of funny tonight, it's kind of slippery. And I thought if I could get there, it'd be the right night to keep, you know, DJ and Otto behind us. Um, and I seen they weren't moving up real quick. I kind of figured that's what was happening. Um, you know, it just, car was good. Car was real good. And we got up front. We held on. Lap traffic was pretty tough. But uh, feels great. Finally, I got more than two wins in one year. I finally got that off my back. I usually can never win more than two. But so far, we got three. We'll just keep trying to get more. Better be lucky than good any day. That's right. That was good. We were just a little bit tight. It's tough, you know, starting in the back. Um, and, and this guy here is tough, and uh, we raced each other great. Uh, it, was, it was a good race, you know. Congrats to Barnes and those guys. It was a good night of racing. Uh, a little off all night. Um, we got to go back to the drawing board. With the thing uh, is a little bit something. Something's off in the front end, and we're going to send it back to Joe and let him look at it and see if he can figure it out. Um, just no front grip uh, ever, uh, all day. So even when the car is a little free in the back, it just doesn't stick the nose. So um, all in all, third place finish. I'm uh, pretty happy with it. Uh, some good racing out there, and uh, we'll come back in uh, a week and try it again.